Hello, Kane University. I'm your student meteorologist, Anthony Dalbo, here with your CaneCast for Thanksgiving week. To take a look at your what to expect headlines for this week, you'll have below normal weekend with temperatures dropping into the mid to low 40s and a wet start to the work week with the low pressure moving in Sunday night into Monday. Cha-ching, that's right. We have our the beginning of our Christmas shopping season Friday, this Friday, November 23rd with Blitz Day or Black Friday, whatever you prefer to call it. And for our weather classroom, we'll be discussing Alberta Clippers. But for your almanac, you'll see an average high of 51 degrees for the area and 37 for this week is a low as an average. But it's not unusual to see record temperatures as high as 75 as we did in 1979 and 12 in 1932. But our record rainfall is 2.74 inches on November 25th, 1950, and our record snowfall occurred on November 23rd, 1989, 5.3 inches of snow. Luckily, we won't have any of that coming our way anytime soon. We have our afternoon highs for this week. The average highs will be around 50 degrees, little variations here and there, but overall around normal temperatures. 40 degrees along the rest of the New England coast and 30s in the tip of Maine. See 70 degrees dropping down into the southern portion of our southeast and the balmy 80 degrees out in Florida. That won't be reaching anytime soon over here. Don't get worried about that. We'll have 40 degrees over the most of the midsection, dropping down mostly 60s throughout the south, uh, south central of the United States, 30s along the Canadian border, and 30s in the elevation of the Rocky Mountains, with 50s along the outstretched court, um, coast of our United States. For our morning lows, overnight lows, most of the United States and the northern portion are full of 30 degrees, but we have 40s for our area, mo the majority of our area, 40 degrees, 50s along the southeast, and 60s, very humid at night in Florida. As you take a look at our west coast, you'll see we have 40 degrees along the immediate coastline, 30s and 20s over the Rocky Mountains, very chilly area over there. Thank God, I hope you're not going over there. It's very cold. Wear a jacket if you do. If you take a look at our future cast, you'll see we have a high pressure south and west of us. This cold front's going to be pushing through Thursday and into Friday. But after that, Friday night, Saturday, high pressure's going to linger. With this low pressure moving up the coast from the south, it's going to bring us very uh, moderate rainfall for Sunday night into Monday. For our Blitz Day forecast, that's right, this Friday, November 23rd, Mostly sunny skies, 47 degrees. Great day to go out there, shop, boost up the economy, help us out. Maybe it'll drop our gas prices, who knows, but we'll see. Get out there, buy some clothes. It's a great day to start shopping. On to your weather classroom. That's right, Alberta Clippers. It's a fast moving low pressure system that moves southwest out of Alberta, Canada through the Plains, Midwest and Great Lakes region, usually during the winter and it's accompanied by light snow, strong winds, and colder temperatures. If you take a look at our graphic here, you'll see that we have this low pressure over Canada that's gonna develop with a come down, bring snowfall through the area. As it matures over the Great Lakes, you can see temperatures dropping behind that into the 20s, even teens, and 30 degree difference from ahead and behind it. Very uh, uh, vast contrast there. And it can dump upwards of very moderate snowfall, one to three inches, but with the winds up to 40 miles an hour, gusting to 60, it does cause blizzard conditions with whiteouts and strong winds called temperatures. But in the meantime, visit our website at hurry.cane.edu. Click on the CaneCast symbol on the left side of the, mo of the screen. There you can find our updated seven days, our forecast discussions and map discussions as we update it daily. For your seven day forecast, you'll see that we have Thanksgiving, you'll see showers coming through, moderate rainfall, 63 degrees, very warm, 36 degrees is a low. Could see 70 degrees in South Jersey if you're heading down there for the travel weekend. 45 degrees and mostly sunny skies on Friday with Saturday, mostly sunny skies still, 43 degrees. Sunday, you have that low pressure moving through and that cold front bringing us showers into Monday, 48 degrees. 53 is a high for Monday. Cloudy conditions on Tuesday, still warm at 62 degrees. Very unseasonable. Closing out the week on Wednesday, mostly sunny, mostly cloudy skies, 47 degrees. I'm your student meteorologist, Anthony Dabo, on behalf of the geology and meteorology department here at Kane. Have a great day.